Daily Message, June 1, 2024. As a pacifier calms down a baby, so does justifying one's sin as not sinful. In other words, defining what is or isn't sin based on one's own truth or that of one's culture in lieu of what is considered a sin in the eyes of God. And just as prolonged use of a pacifier could lead to dental problems, so could defining what is or isn't sin based on other than God's written word lead to negative outcomes. For when Christ returns or God calls us home, it will be our deviation from obedience to God's character and will that we will be held accountable for. So let us stop deceiving ourselves. If we think we are wise by this world's standards, we need to become a fool to be truly wise. For the wisdom of this world is foolishness to God. And unlike this fickle world, God's written word is steadfast. For as Jesus said, heaven and earth will pass away, but my words will never pass away. So let us be prepared for Jesus' second coming and or for God to call us home by letting the Holy Spirit direct our steps and by not trusting in our own truth or that of our culture. For it is written in Isaiah 55, verses 8 through 9, For my thoughts are not your thoughts, nor are your ways my ways, declares the Lord. For as the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways, and my thoughts than your thoughts. With love to all, Pastor Cheryl.